Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. And today I'm gonna to be, before, I wanna show you guys this foam mount that I just recently purchased. Um, I came across this mount on eBay. It's actually pretty cool um, because you actually get to mount it right here um, in the center. So you can keep your phone up kind of like at the same view as the navigation is. Now, I know other people would prefer to mount their mounts on the driver's side vent. Um, I've seen others mounted like that somewhere down here. Uh, but like I was saying, I prefer for the mount to be somewhere up near the vents. That way it's um, kind of almost eye level in a way. Um, so I don't have to look downward if I'm following navigation um, directions or trying to switch through a um, different playlist. But it's really simple. Um, I'll show you guys how to install it. All you have to do is there's four bolts on each side. So all you have to do is once you place it, have it in place, you just want to tighten it up with the Allen key that it comes with. And it's four bolts. And once you have the four bolts in place, you can tell it's not going to go anywhere. Um, the only thing that I'm not a fan of is the stripes. Um, you guys can tell that they're supposed to be the M stripes, but these two colors are completely off. This one's more of a, uh, this one's actually, the one in the middle is actually purple. And um, the other one is a brighter blue, which is supposed to be like a light blue. But the cool thing about this is that once you mount it, you can actually twist it. So you can have it this way, or if you can have it straight, you can line it up, then you got it straight. So when it comes to driving, just you can just tilt it and bam. There you go. I think it's pretty cool. It doesn't really get in the way of the hazard light. So let's say if you have your phone and you need to hit the unlock button, you can always just reach behind it if you don't want to take your phone off. But it's you know it's, you can just take it off real quick and then put it back on. But yeah, guys, as you guys can see, I'm sweating. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's pretty hot. I had to leave the window up because the you guys know where I'm filming right now. I'm right next to the highway and the noise is kind of loud and then there's the bugs going on and everything. So it's kind of too much going on at once. So I'm trying to keep the audio as good as possible. Okay, so I realized that I deleted my outro and I wasn't done talking to you guys about the phone mount. Um, I actually wanted to give you guys a little bit more information about it. I'm going to put a link in the description of where I got it. And um, there's going to be another link below it. And that's the link where you can actually get them in either a red or a blue color as well. Now those are actually going to be coming from overseas. So you're going to be paying a little bit more, uh, which I think is like two, three dollars more. And also you're probably going to have to wait on shipping time a little bit longer than um, if you were to order from California. Now the reason why I went with the black one was because for one, like I said, it was in California. Um, shipping time was a few days. Uh, and uh, I mean, black just looks more OEM. I didn't, I personally didn't want anything to stick out too much and kind of look out of place. And um, I mean, it's, the, the mount does its job. Uh, you really can't go wrong with it. And it's actually, you know, it, it'll come in handy when it comes to driving it. Uh, I've been using a different kind of mount and I mean, this is gonna make my life easier when it comes to putting on the phone it, um, just to kind of keep it handy like whenever I need it uh, but yeah guys that's pretty much gonna do it for today's video if this video was any kind of helpful in any kind of way um, do me a favor and hit the like button if you haven't already subscribed I'm not sure if I'm gonna be working on the E46 or the Audi A3 but right now I am gonna be putting out more F30 videos uh, so stay tuned for those uh, but yeah guys thank you so much for watching I don't know if I said it but if you haven't already hit that subscribe button um, and once again drop a like thank you guys and i'll see you in the next one